So another um, item that uh, drew a lot of attention was this gun bill, the, the so-called uh, concealed carry bill. Uh, yes. Seemed to have a really rough time uh, making its, its way, at least in terms of the amount of debate about it. Uh, the votes maybe didn't reflect that, but this is going to face some legal challenges, and, and supporters of the bill itself understand that, right? Absolutely. I'm the prime sponsor in the Senate. Uh, I believe that the it, it's unassailable that people have the right to bear arms. What that actually means has been the subject of a debate for, for decades, if not centuries. Uh, and guns are different now than they were when the constitutions were written in this country. So I believe that we need to take every step to safeguard people from from carrying guns. Uh, I, I've never been against the right to own a gun. Uh, certainly, we need to put reasonable restrictions on that. Uh, having people own guns in their home is certainly something that's, even in New Jersey, is not that difficult. But to carry it around legally is a whole different ballgame for the New Jersey I grew up in, not used to seeing people carrying guns around. And I, I think that that just leads to potential for more and more conflict. Yeah, I mean, you, you say you're a main sponsor. Where do you think um, the, the courts are going to find a, a middle ground? Is there a middle ground to be found here? I mean, is, is, do they draw the line at churches, schools, hospitals? So um, that's, that's obviously going to be the subject of, of a legal challenge. I have no doubt in, in my mind that that's going to occur. We tried to, to put together a bill that would have the best possible a chance to survive legal scrutiny. Uh, we got, uh, in fact, I was personally involved in in getting law enforcement to not only back the bill, but to uh, put position papers out and to testify in favor of the permit restriction bill. And that's what it is, essentially. Uh, putting some, some guidelines onto uh, gun carrier permits in New Jersey. The right to bear arms is still there. This is the next step, obviously, for the viewers that don't know that the United States Supreme Court overturned a similar statute in New York, which had the effect of overturning the one in New Jersey. So we've had to come up with uh, a new set of regulations when people could get carrier permits in New Jersey. Most of the law enforcement people that I know are very much uh, Second Amendment advocates. But I think every cop that I've spoken to about this says they don't want more people carrying guns, especially in, in these sensitive areas. And, you know, I had many conversations with the leaders of law enforcement, PBA, uh, FOP, Retired Officers Association, STFA, and they're uh, in support of this bill. We worked with them. I thought it was extraordinarily important to have law enforcement saying to the public, this is a good bill. This is good for public safety. And they're on board with what we, what we came up with. So I, I think we did a very good job with a piece of legislation that's going to pass.